So now that we've finished the whole haircut, uh, the bulk of the haircut, what I want to do is I'm going to use my uh, adjustable clipper and we're just going to finish the taper around the outline of the haircut. So I'm going to start here on the right hand side and use a 45 degree angle. And just taper that out before I come back with my outliner and make the line. We're going to bend his head forward. And we're just going to use a scooping motion with the clipper in the all the way open position. And then we're going to close it down all the way. So here I'm leaving a very low natural hairline. He doesn't have a lot of hair on his neck, but we still want this faded out nicely. And then before I pick up the before I pick up the trimmer, the one last step I want to do is uh, spin him around and check my mirror and make sure that it looks the way it's supposed to, the way I want it to. Okay. So we're happy with the way that looks. So now we're just going to finish around this ear and then I'm going to grab my outliner and that will be the final step before we style the top. Okay, so now we'll go ahead and grab the outliner. And we're going to get in front of the ear here. Then we're going to bend his head to pop the hair out, and we're just going to line it off right there on his neck. And then we're going to shave up. I'm going to pull this down right to his t-shirt line. He really doesn't have a lot of hair on his neck, but I want to make sure we don't miss uh, you know, any strays. And we don't want to get too close to the um, the outline, so we don't want to put a hole in it and have to redo it. We like having to redo a whole fade. Okay, and then we're going to bend his head to the side so that pops the hair out. We're going to get it nice and close. Okay, and then in front of the ear here. Alright, that completes the haircut, and now we're going to go ahead and move on to the style. Before I do that, I just want to clean the hair cloth off first. So what I'm going to do is just loosen them up, shake the hair off. So he likes a strong hold, a very strong hold with a good shine because when, if you look at his hair, his hair is really straight and just wants to stand up. So he wants it to lean to the side. So what we need for that is uh, we're going to use our, our firm hold gel, which is, which is water based. And basically I like to refer to it as um, um, just a lighter version of our pomade. It's more of like a pomade gel than it is just a gel. Water based, no alcohol. Um, works best when it goes in when the hair is dry. So I'm going to use a little bit extra because his hair is stubborn. And then uh, it's gonna it's gonna hold it it's gonna hold it right in place. So it's it's really thick, and it works. As I said, it works just like a pomade. Um, when you put it the hair in, it holds like a, a firm hold pomade, but it spreads like a gel. So it's a very versatile product. So that gets it that gets it that get that straight hair that was standing right up to bend to the side. You know, a lighter. Uh, gel with a lot of alcohol in it is not going to do that. And there's one more thing I want to show you with the beard before before we finish up here. Because his beard is very thick and very coarse. A lot of people like to use a beard oil or some type of styling product in their beard. What I like to use on, on beards, especially like this, is our grooming cream. Our grooming cream is a uh, 
It's a, it's a styling cream. And it has uh, coconut oil in it, which is very moisturizing. So what I like to do is uh, take a little bit of it, about this much, and rub it really good in my hands. And we're gonna rub it right into the beard. So for anybody using uh, grooming cream for their hair, they can also use it for their beards. And then what we'll do is we'll take our fine tooth comb and we're gonna comb that right through. And it's gonna give it a little bit of, a little bit of hold a little bit of shine to match his hair but the other thing that it does is it um, it holds it holds it all in place so any of the any of the coarse hairs that are spiraling out of control it's going to moisturize and condition those and hold them in place and it changes the it changes the whole look it fits right in with the with the hair with the haircut so that's one way to change the whole look of the beard as well